Uh, that turnovers are such a, a huge part of basketball. And dribbling in and getting the bucket to go. There is Sidney Hilliard. Uh, we have seen a lot of turnovers already in this game. Already the third total turnover so far. And there's a jump shot up and good, and that's a three. And Sam Height, Caton in the far corner. Dishes it all the way to the other side to Ruby Porter. And Porter's going to take it herself and lay it up and in. And Nebraska building on that lead. Sam Hybe with eight seconds left to try and give Nebraska a nine-point lead or more. Here's a jump shot up and good with two seconds remaining. And Hybe is able to add on to the lead and give Nebraska their largest lead of the game. She's only taken two shots, but she's missed them both. She's somebody that Wisconsin really needs to get going here if they want to come back in this game. Um, obviously, Wisconsin has a lot of good players, but Amani Lewis is just one of the best, one of the best ath athletes on this Badger team. Fear leader in blocks for Nebraska's program history, and that one is up and good by Hilliard. And on the other end, Ruby Porter. Badger leader in points tonight, now with eight. She is three of seven from the field. And Annika Stewart now a turnaround quickly on the other end. Nebraska wasting no time, and they have gotten everything they've wanted. 14 of their 30 points have been inside the paint or down low, and they are dominating Wisconsin in that part of the floor. Here's a dribble drive. Lewis up and good with the left hand. And continues to grab those boards, her seventh of the game. And back the other way goes Sam Hybe into the paint. Nothing but net. Sam Hybe can do no wrong. Brooke Schrammick misses the first shot she attempts. And back the other way go the Huskers as a result. And there's a three by Hybe. Up and good. Sam Hybe on fire right now. Early enrollee for Nebraska. Tell us a little bit about, about her, her role and her story. I was wondering if she'd get some minutes. This, she was an early enrollee, like you said, as Wisconsin hits that three there. But Coley... Now we're seeing that slow tempo as the shot clock now down to just five. Stapleton down low, and that one up and good for Hilliard. Has only out has only out-rebounded them in a season total by three. Not very much differential between them and a team like Nebraska in most statistical categories as that one's up and good. The difference between Nebraska and Wisconsin is that Nebraska wins games off of the stat sheet. So things that you can't control, you know, or that you can't control, hustle stats. They knock down a three there. Kalen, no signs of, sh of slowing down for Nebraska whatsoever. Not right now. And the way that Wisconsin is playing defense, there's not much that they can do. And offensively, Nebraska's defense is just stepping up. Like you saw right there, Bella Craven's getting in there and getting the block. Good thing is about the game of basketball is that it's a game of runs. Things can change quickly. So for the Badgers, they just need to string a along a couple really good plays, get some momentum, but that doesn't help. For the Badgers, despite the record, she has been a solid player. Here's a three on the other end, up and good. And the Huskers continue to build. Sarah Stapleton, her first points of the second half, and she now with 10 points in the game, double digits, the third Badger in that category. Here's a three, up and good. Whitney Brown knocks it down. Looks like we have a whistle and a foul as well. Whenever a player loses the ball or commits a turnover, yep. they always turn up the intensity on defense just a little bit to try to make up for it. Yeah, defense wins games. Down low, Sarah Stapleton able to get around the defense of Kate Kane. 66-48, Nebraska leading. Bella Cravens down to Hybe, down to Kane. Kane goes up. Kane gets it to go in. Um, which is fine because when you have a lead like this, 22 points, and you're just you just keep on on winning battles in the paint, getting steals, turnovers, and great passes, great ball movement, right there. Inbound underneath the Husker basket, Amani Lewis goes up with it with the left hand and is able to get it. To I think another stat, Jake, like I mentioned, was the for Nebraska how they have the seven blocks, the five steals, and they score again there. Wisconsin, no blocks, no steals. A long three there, but it falls, and Tara Stauffacher with three points. Coming up with it is Thompson against Kane, got free for a moment, and the ball is collected by Hybe on the opposite end of the floor. Badgers trying to get back on D, but Hybe's going to beat them to the rim, lay it up and in. Ruby Porter tried to go up with one, couldn't get it to land. And a minute and a half remaining, the Badgers on the other end. A quick two points there for Sydney Hilliard. Now she has 16 points tonight, and they have now lost 11 straight and are 0-11 still sitting 
14th in the Big Ten. Nebraska wins it 84 to 68.